Hello everyone and welcome back to another amazing vlog. I am back in the capital of Colombia, Bogota, and girl, you better get ready because today it's all about the food. I'm gonna take you around on a culinary experience of the best places to eat food in Bogota, Colombia. You might not know this, but actually over here you will find Michelin star restaurants, great fast food, and amazing typical food. So guys, I am back in Bogota. <clears throat> we just left um, Cartagena, and it was a beautiful experience. Um, you're probably gonna be getting that uh, video separately, so go and check it out because it was a nice experience. I, I was there just for like three days, but I really, really, really enjoy it. So it was nice, the weather was great, but now I am back in the capital. I'm gonna be here for the next, like a lot of days, you know, well not, not at all, like like eight days, you know, with my family and stuff. So I'm gonna keep showing you around because this city is so huge and there's still so many things to do, right? So, yeah. Our first stop is Viva La Vida. This is a Japanese fusion restaurant run by executive chef and Michelin star winner, Felix Jimenez bringing you an, a spiritual experience that is literally set to take you into another world. Every piece on this restaurant is a call for inner peace and self-love, so you will open your mind and get ready to taste one of the most amazing flavors I have ever had in a Japanese restaurant here in Bogota, Colombia. Start your night with an amazing glass of wine and then move into the amazing sushi that they have. This is popcorn sushi, guys. A mix that I have never tasted before and it was so amazing. Now, this place is also known for their mixology and the cocktails, the variety of amazing cocktails that they have and the story behind each cocktail is just something that you do not want to miss. At this 24 karat gold cocktail like girl the secret garden no i mean every and the taste guys the taste of everything is just something that you will not try anywhere else This restaurant in itself is a whole experience. Be prepared to be there for at least two hours. The food, oh my, the, these flavors. Guys, I can still taste all of this food, guys. The rice, the octopus, the, I mean, everything. It, just, it was just amazing. <laughs>
Now from a Michelin star restaurant to traditional Colombian food, guys, you have to come to this next little restaurant. It's called Doña Segunda and they sell this typical, typical Colombian dish that is called picada, which is basically a mix of potato and blood sausage and a chorizo and different meats and plantains and it all like served in there. It's very typical guys, you cannot leave Colombia without trying this at least once and not from a fancy restaurant but from places like this, very small community neighborhoodly uh, places. In the morning guys, you have to come to any bakery, they sell uh, Colombian tamales which are very unique, very different from Mexico tamales, okay, these are actually good. Uh, you have the arepas with cheese, you have uh, soup, you have all the typical Colombian breakfast. Now very quickly, Colombia is also known for the very good health services that they have over here you know and it's very cheap so i went to the best dentist in colombia which is called Mar marlon becerra to get a, a white whitening you know situation and it was so good and it was so cheap guys you, you have to do it Hi guys, it's like day, I don't know what. We're still in Bogota, Colombia, and I'm in this restaurant called El Kiosco that my friend is saying is like the most amazing thing you will ever try on breakfast. So, um, no, thank you. So, um, that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna be eating because that's what we, we do in Colombia. As I told you in my previous videos of Bogota, this is a city full of malls. They all the decoration in every single one of them is amazing, especially during the Christmas times. So make sure to check them all out if you can, because each one of them has their own vibe, their own decorations, their own stores. Like girl, you will have the time of your life. Now another restaurant that I have to recommend you and is very very popular here in Bogota it's called Andres Carne de Res which is uh, this very popular restaurant all about meat all about traditional Colombian food very bougie a huge restaurant they have two restaurants one outside of the city and another one in a mall called El Retiro and it's beautiful they celebrate a tradition and culture and the food is really great
Now, after this amazing dinner, it was time to give the surprise and the perfect Christmas gift to my grandmother. I have been saving this moment for a very long time, but this was the time that I wanted to give my grandmother the trip of her dreams. She has always wanted to go to different parts around the world and I decided to make that dream come true because this woman here she raised me she gave me her everything so it was a little payback for all the beautiful things that um, we did before so I'm gonna be taking her to Barcelona Rome and Athens and this is the moment that she find out It was definitely the best feeling in the world to be able to give her a little bit of happiness after everything that she has done for me during her whole life and after all of this well you know what we just need to keep eating to keep you know being happy another well-known restaurant it's called Don Hediondo and they also have typical Colombian food guys look at this chicken and this is tongue Cow tongue, girl, it was so good. Now, if you have been watching my previous video, you know that my husband was sick and had to stay back. Well, this is where my husband finally returned to Bogota, we finally met each other, so I have to take him back to that Michelin star restaurant, Viva La Vida, because it was so good, and I wanted him to have this whole experience. Look, here he is trying the very famous popcorn sushi that I showed you guys before. It's just like this place, it's so amazing. The food, honestly, you cannot go wrong. No matter what you order from their menu, it is just amazing. And from dessert, this time we decided to order a dessert. They have like these mochi balls which with a uh, raised paper and you literally can paint and do your own painting and then you eat your own dessert. Like, tell me that this is not the most creative thing that you have seen in a restaurant. Like, hello?
but because you can never have enough food in Colombia and we have a lot of family after this we literally have to go to another restaurant to meet our family which is called crepes and waffles guys you have to go to crepes and waffles no matter what okay the food the desserts the ice creams the everything no like this is the most popular restaurant in Colombia you will love 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 it and that was pretty much it for this trip after all of these adventures in Colombia that happened it was a great trip with a little bit of obstacles you know if you have watched my videos if you know you know but we in general we have a great time um, but we are ready to go back home and relax because I think that we need a vacation from this vacation to be very honest so thank you so much for watching this video for coming with me on this great adventure but there is so much more coming now that you know that i'm gonna be going with my grandmother to this one in a lifetime adventure that is coming next so thank you for watching and don't forget to like this video share this video subscribe to my youtube channel and guys do not be afraid to come to colombia because it's a beautiful beautiful place full of surprises full of love the food is amazing the people is incredible and believe me on vacation you will have the time of your life so i love you guys and i'll see you around see ya bye